footage just yet. I want to go through just a closer look at this track. So right now, it is a major category four hurricane with maximum sustained winds at 140 miles per hour. Again, this is the latest information that we have just came down from the National Hurricane Center, uh, keeping the intensity as a category four hurricane as the storm approaches the Bahamas right there over the northwestern Bahamas and then continuing towards the state of Florida. Now we're looking at Tuesday, early Tuesday morning. So overnight Monday into Tuesday, this storm starts to make that curve uh, to the north, riding up along the east side of the state. You can see uh, just off uh, the shore there from Daytona Beach and then up towards uh, the border of Georgia and Florida Georgia border here uh, with maximum sustained winds at 125 miles per hour, still a category three storm. I want you to see though, this cone of uncertainty, even though there is no direct with this latest update, there is no landfall showing in the state of Florida. We're still in this cone of uncertainty, so we don't want to get too comfortable just yet. Uh, then the storm will continue again, latest track showing it weakening down to a category two hurricane right there at the border of South Carolina and Georgia uh, with maximum sustained winds at 110 miles per hour. Uh, that would be early Thursday morning. So again, watch that cone of uncertainty, even though this latest track doesn't show landfall in Florida, doesn't show that eye coming on shore, uh, that cone of uncertainty is still covering uh, much of the state.